We were all so sad when you left. After the accident. Oh, fuck this. Uh -huh. My daughter didn't drown. You're remembering wrong. She's at home watching Night Springs with her father. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. It's useless. I need to stop the story. Why didn't you mention Tor was hurt? No, I wanna... Okay, sorry. Mandy Man Norman said Tor is hurt. Why didn't you mention that earlier? Oh, you mean the little bump on his noggin? <laughs> it's nothing. The residents like to exaggerate. Uh-huh. I need to check Tor's room. Okay, Sorry, why is... Saga, that area is for staff only. Okay, you know I have weapons, right? What's in the wellness center? Oh, that's where we provide our health services to the residents. We have a rehab facility, dining area, and beds for special round-the-clock care. To stay young, stay limber. Like I said, they have a shotgun. Okay, what do we have over here? Let's just check around. It is important that we gather all of the necessary items. Oh, have you seen the way Tor has been slobbering over Cynthia? He's like a horny teenager. Oh, what's wrong with her? A little romance at our age. Bro, get some clothes on. Okay, I guess we search that. There's nothing there. Okay, we can open that if necessary. Let's go to the second floor. Okay, map. We search everything there except for the wellness center, which is locked. And there's uh, some s basement, which you need to go through there. Okay, and there is something behind me. And nothing, of course. Okay, standard search pattern. I don't have the key. Okay. All gods of Asgard, Museum and Hall of Pain. Books. I shouldn't interrupt him. The government built a bunker here during World War II to watch the ocean for Axis navies and who knows what else. Ever since they sealed the bunker, it's been a hot spot for teens. Oh. The Ocean View Motel and Spa, they call it. Ironically, oh. I believe. They go there to enjoy their beer and their vapes and electronic cigarettes. The vapes, bro. Ridiculous. The future is... <clears throat> Thank you. So, so you're doing a podcast or something? Do other stuff that isn't appropriate content for you listeners at home, but the bunker has a tendency to flood, especially during the winter. In the 90s, a, a group of teens went down there one Saturday night and got a little drunker than usual. The teens noticed one girl, Nora Hesberg, was missing. Okay. They figured she just went home. When Nora's folks didn't find her in her bed the next morning, they called the police. Okay, so this guy is running like the... Like a... Bright Falls uh, podcast. Nora floating in one of the flooded passages. Damn! She had a real talent for music. <laughs> Folks say they, they still hear her singing in the nursing home. Nowadays, t teens think the bunker is haunted. That doesn't stop them from going there. The police have tried to lock it up, but you know young people, they're persistent. Now, as for myself, an impartial journalist, mm -hmm. I have lived here at the Valhalla Nursing Home for five years. And okay. in that time, I have never heard Nora's singing. 
just the humming of a certain neighbor of mine who has an inexplicable love for Finnish tango. Is there Finnish tango? That's weird. Okay, I think you finished your podcast. I'm gonna I'm gonna leave you alone. Thank you for the I think it was batteries. Recreation room. Oh shoebox. Um I guess we are good for now. I'm gonna move that over there. I'm gonna move that over there. Move this over here. Can I open this? This is bad. Oh, there's a point of interest over there in Thor's room. I'm gonna do the saving. Nice. Nothing there. Poor thing. Yeah, the deer fest, you know? They shoot deers. Okay, I need more ammo. Why isn't there more ammo around? This is nursing home, after all. This is Tor's room. Yeah. Okay. The room is a little bit trashed. More moonshine. Yeah. Was this a drunken rampage? Maybe. This place is a mess. And Tor's not here. I need to keep looking. Was well, a little bit of moonshine. Mm. Okay. Our room is empty. Maybe Odin can tell me what happened? Okay. So, did we see the point of interest? Yes. Odin, Odin and Donna. Excuse me, miss, but you don't see me barging into your room while you're performing mental and physical strengthening exercises, do you? No, sorry. I thought not. Sorry. <laughs> don't mind me. And now I have to start over. Come on. Come on, give me 20 of those. Come on. Breakfast is at 7. Tomorrow will be eggs, toast, grapefruit, orange juice, tea, coffee. Damn. Service stops at 9. Lunch at 11. Tomorrow is borscht with oyster crackers. The other choice is stewed beef. Stewed beef. I will have borscht. No, no, there's too beef. Cranberry juice or water is served as well. Cranberry Service juice. Service stops at 12.30. Uh, it's a little bit early for my taste. You know anything else? How about dinner? Or do you have tea? No? Tea time at 2.30. Okay, the thank coffee you. Coffee is also served. A cookie tray is available. Delicious. Maximum of two per resident. If it's somebody's birthday, then cake is served instead of cookies. Yum. There is no birthday tomorrow. So, cookies. Okay. Tea time awesome. ends at 3.30. Tea is delicious. And dinner? What about around five? Come on, lady. Give me the schedule. Why do you have toilet paper over there? Come on, give me the schedule. Dinner is at five. Okay, five. All residents must join. Exceptions made for health reasons. The protein is chicken or fish, asparagus and potatoes roasted. Asparagus is Dessert delicious. Is fruit cup or chocolate brownie. Mm, Discussion brownie. encouraged. Tomorrow's topic is the history of Deerfest. I should write down possible points to bring up. Uh, yes. I like this lady. You know, she's keeping in shape, thinking things through. Odin, okay. 
Odin's in bad shape. Yeah. He was drunk and watery. Or is this something more serious? That woman in the painting looks like mom. Was I mm. born here? Or is this more of the story? The Anderson family, 1989. Cases. Fact versus fiction. There you go. This looks exactly like mom, and that's me. Still part of the story. The sea of night. To drink from the cup of the wise one for wisdom to be a seer. I gave up my eye in the light of the moon to shine and see. These are lyrics. Where did I put the eye? Before time, I gave it to Mimir to drink from the well of wisdom, the cauldron. 1976, I took it out myself to see, drank the moonshine. 1988, he who stands in the threshold took it from me. Time will come again, to be writ again. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Hey, Odin, how are you? Can you hear me, Odin? <laughs> I have some questions. Odin Anderson, can you hear me? I need to ask you a couple of questions. Odin? He's in no shape to talk. Yeah, and there was some sort of echo. Let's do some profiling on Odin. Hangover. Odin's in rough shape. What happened to him? These are our twilight years. There's darkness in the water. We have our little tricks. And so do you. What's happening? It's never felt this way before. You're all grown up, Saga dearest. And you're back just in time. The forces of darkness are eating away at us. We're too old and weak. You have the power in you, like all Andersons. What Interesting. was that? He's communicating he was in the... Projection. No. Odin was really here. Yeah, he was communicating th we to you in the, in the mind palace. Are they really my family? Yeah, I guess so. Is that why this is happening? The cold photo. I found a photograph of you with the cultists. How are you involved? We're too old for this brand of crazy. But we'll drink with anyone who's offering. The cult's been on our asses to join for years. But we already have our band. And those damn fools don't know what they're dealing with. No wonder they want a pair of legends. Tor and Odin are not part of the cult. The cult thinks there's something special about Tor and Odin. I'm starting to see it too. Interesting. I've never connected to someone like this in my mind place before. How is this happening? Except for Dr. I was Watson. I'm glad to answer your call. Vikings are born travelers. You are a seer. You can see the truth. But your grandpa will want to tell you more himself. Wouldn't want to steal his thunder. Tor is in danger. You can save him. Is my mind place more than just a mental technique? Sometimes my mind place even baffles me. Is this the reason? Yeah. Is there something more than intuition behind it? One thing at a time. Tor is in trouble. Tor is in trouble. Once I help him. He can maybe tell me more. Indeed. Uh, Thor in danger. You said Thor is in danger. What's going on? Darkness is drawn to the spark. Thor only thinks with his hammer, never his head. The 
Prince of fucking darkness is making a comeback. Tor is marked by darkness. I can feel it. Is he in his room? It wants to take him, and then take me. Oh, crap. Beware of Cynthia Weaver. Bad things happen in the wellness center. Don't let her drag him under, Saga. Does Prince of Darkness refer to Scratch? Is Tor becoming taken? I need to find him before it's too late. Yeah, maybe. Stop this before more people get hurt. I understand. What about the clicker? I found Wake's clicker. What can you tell me about it? Cut off from Tom's lamp. It washed to the shore. Good work getting the light switch. The light switch is like an amp. You can play rock and roll without it, but you won't blow anyone away. Art, like Tom's writing, can change the world. But the light switch will crank that change to 11. The clicker has the power to change the story. Mm-hmm. To save Logan. This confirms what Wake said. I can't let Scratch get his hands on the clicker. By Tom's writing, Odin must mean Wake. Um, no, Tom Zane. Okay. Case board. The Anderson brothers. Okay, so. This is why Wake needs the clicker. Can he be trusted with the power to change reality? Can anyone? Thor, look for Thor in the in the room. Thor is not okay. Something's Something wrong with Thor. Going on here. Wellness center, yeah, most likely. The clicker makes Wake's writing change reality. Can I trust him with that much power? Probably not. Not sure I have a choice. Clicker amplifies Wake's writing. Has power to fix this, make it worse. Yeah. Oh, we need more things. The Cult of the Tree. Thor. While the cult has been trying to recruit them for years, he and Odin rejected all of their offers. So this one over there. Not called members. Okay. See you later. Uh, I think you're great uncle, right? This lady is still pumping. Oh. Nice. Okay, so. Find Thor. Talk to Rose. We go up. Let's see if there's anything up here. Getting in is forbidden for your own safety. Time okay. is long for those who wait. But in the end, stand to thanks. Sheesh, <laughs> didn't see you there. Weird, huh? Oh, this is Hattie's room. You know, Hattie is some sort of interdimensional, almost all-powerful, godlike entity. Mandy May. Okay. I will take the ammo. I will take all of the ammo. All of the things. Nice. I appreciate when you give me more ammo. What else do we have here? Riddle through the ages. Over 200 teasers, tickles, and twisters. Note to self, hide the thing with a nice little riddle like this. Better than any actual lock. To get to the other side, but Reese wants 250 other this world pawns to help you with conversation go swimmingly. Hashtag bomb. 
there anything back here? No. We a big house. Need the key. Gail. Pinthia. Okay, apparently there are keys here. Do you have the keys, Atty? No? Hmm. Okay. Talk to Rose. I guess we investigated everything here. All we need now is to go down, talk to Rose. And we are going to get the keys from her. Or we're gonna shoot her in the face. Hey, Rose. Tor's in the wellness center, isn't he? No, he's... Well, yes, but you really shouldn't go in there right now. I'm gonna need you to unlock the door. This is FBI business. But it's just... There's some things that, uh... I'm gonna shoot you in the face, lady. <sighs> Open the thing. Right over there. Yes, okay. I'll let you in. Thank you. Thank you, Rose. Don't push me. The wellness center. Before we do that... Odin uh, said Thor needs help. But from what? The, the dark place. Is he turning into a Taken? Thor becoming Taker? Where is Thor? Watch out. <laughs> Shut up! You can hurt yourself in the dark. Right. Um... Thanks. Thanks. That lady is a walking red flag. Yeah. Uh, can we save somewhere around here? I think we can save, right? Where are the things for us to save? Yeah, Rose, you're losing it. Okay, this is so weird. I was sure there was some place where we could save around here. Oh, Ati's back here as well. Nope, there's nothing actually. Basement. Okay, you're going in a little bit bananas, aren't you? There's a the wellness center. It immediately gets dark. Can't open this with my bare hands. You have a shotgun, lady. Wellness center, Bright Falls. We get the wellness center map. That's locked. Staff lounge. Computer. Something over there. Security room. Okay, why is this place like Dark. haunted? Empty. Be ready, Saga. Nothing. You can poop over there. Hmm. Okay, that's like a safe place. Can we enter this? Why is this door not opening? Oh, I just came through that door. Now I came through this door. Could get maybe some snacks. Hello? Tor? Hello? 
It's Anybody? Saga Anderson. Anybody around? Okay, give me all of this. Nice, we got a lot of batteries now. Nothing there. Locked. Anybody around? This wellness center is kind of big. How many people do you usually get in this area? Manuscript page. The history of the... Thor is bewitched. Thor Anderson had lightning in his veins. This was rock and roll, baby. That weaver girl had cast a spell on him. Tor would do anything she'd ask. Tor deserved this. Tor wanted this. She wanted the song. A gift. He had to get it for her. Afterwards, it was too late. Tor swung his hammer in frustration. The spark was gone. Black liquid clogged his mind. A bad trip. Tor fought it. He was strong. He'd never be taken. But the darkness could still drown him. Tor needed to warn someone. It was all happening again. Tom was back. Coming back. Tom would need help too if he was going to make it. But the brothers were too old to stop at this time. Mm. Tor had called someone. Someone who could help. The name escaped him. Drowned beneath dark water. Okay, easy now. Hello? Okay, something bad happened here. He's hurt pretty bad, but he tore off his bandages. Why? Rose. R Doc, Rose and me found Mr. Anderson knocked out on floor, uh, on floor by phone. Burns on hands and cut on head. Was out cold, so brought him here, been acting strange all week. Take good care of uh, his VIP. Tor was here. Yeah. Seeing the case board. So, Charles says Tor behavior has been increasingly volatile. No, becoming taken. Violently? Where is Thor? No. Becoming taken? Why remove a bandage when you're still bleeding? Thor, the sign bed is empty. Was brought here to rest, didn't stay long. <laughs> hmm. Thor is being targeted. He needs help. Not taken, dark presence manipulating him, destroying him. Maybe. I will therefore shoot first, ask questions later. Can't be opened on this side. You, they usually can't. Hold on. Tor, wait! It's me! Crap. There's a deduction available. Left through the cafeteria. Tor left the wellness center. Okay. Oh, Jesus come on. Christ. The door is locked electronically, it said. Yeah, this wellness center is kind of spooky. Inventory is full. Is there a box around here? I would like to save because there's a, a lot of stuff here. On the dark roads of Montana There's a shadow in the dirt 
The whisper of a mountaineer In a ragged flannel shirt He walks the stony hillsides With his mandolin in hand But you'll never see his face around this long forgotten land